Hang on a mo. Why are you all dead already? Legs protrude from the hole. I think it's dead. I mean, this certainly looks like a bear escaped and murdered everybody. You know what I mean? A chasm. Snake eater. The underdark is everything I thought it'd be. The underdark? Disarm. Twelve at least. Go the other way. Is this how it's gonna be? Is this how it's gonna be all day? All fucking day? Twice! Fuck off! Fuck off! It's a big shiny fucking chest. I don't- oh, I'm gonna- Is this cause they said fuck rogues? Is that all? Look rogues, I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. I was just feeling- I- I really am sorry. I really am. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean it. <laughs> They really don't want me to know what's in here. They both listen. What? Neve, if you weren't here when I told you this story, would you believe me? There's gonna be fuck all in here. We taking bets? We taking bets? What's in here? 22 gold and gloves that I can't use. I wasn't too far off. What do you wear? Medium armor. Here, take that. That's yours now. Now, I worry that I'm gonna go straight into a fight here. So here's my game plan. We take a long rest. Then we go and see if I have fucked everything up. Somebody with better perception. We all failed. Is that us fucked then? My question is, why is it always me? It's like, it's, it's just, it's always me. Fuck it anyway. It's just so fucked up. Scratcher, the only thing that hasn't failed me. Including my own senses. We go to bed. Something weird. Of course. Oh no. This is the normal one, isn't it? No. I promised I'd be back. Don't worry. I have things under control. For now. I believe you. Papa. I see you've been using the powers the tadpole gives you. Good. But things haven't gone as you expected. You thought Nettie might be able to help you in the Druid's Grove. But all she did was try to kill you. Ah, uh, yeah, but we fixed that. You're desperate to be rid of it. Understandable. But you're looking for solutions in the wrong places. I don't care about the tab, but I've been offered a greater power by my butler. No, I don't want to. No. <laughs> so, what should I be doing? Your parasite is unusual. It is wrapped in magic that prevents its removal. Until the source of the tadpole's magic is destroyed, any attempt to remove it will kill you. The parasites were merely a symptom of a greater sickness in Faerun. What is the sickness? The absolute aims are not yet clear to me. But its progress towards domination is clear. These parasites are more than illicit spawn. They are vessels for control. The infected hear the voice of the Absolute and believe it to be a god. You witnessed it yourself with Priestess Gut. That is how the cult of the Absolute is spreading. The highest of their rank, the true souls, carry a tadpole just like yours. It is how they receive their orders. It is what makes them obey. When the order to transform is given, it will not be a matter of days. They will be mind flayers in an instant. Oh. Were it not for my protection, so would you. So who are you? It's complicated. But I'm an adventurer. Just like you. 
Just like you, I was infected with a mind flayer parasite. Just like you, I seek to be free of it. I've been trying to escape from this evil for a long time. Once, I almost succeeded. Now, through you, I've been given a new chance. You can go where I cannot, and I can protect you from that evil. If we work together, we may turn this around. Hells, they need me. I have to go. Tell me where I can find you. No. It isn't safe. The power I used to protect you. I stole it from someone. They want it back. I will hold them off for as long as I can. But sooner or later I will be worn down. You must discover the source of the magic that controls the parasites before that happens. Follow the cultist's trail. They will lead you to their masters. <laughs> Use the powers your parasite gives you to convince them you are one of them. And when you find the source of their magic, destroy it. You want me undercover? Go. Our freedom depends on it. He's got very dramatic fucking hand movements. I take it we all had the dream, yeah? Does anybody want to talk about it? Whoa! What's up? What's up? Through a ball held firmly in his mouth. No way. There we go. Oh, what have I got? What have I got? He relinquished ah, it. you dope. It is well chewed and slick with drool. You're not gonna travel for him? Alistair! Hey, buddy. No way! I know it's not the most interesting thing in the world, but that's fucking cool. A scout just reported. The goblin's leadership has been decimated. We might escape this place yet. That was me. I did that. The one to thank. Yeah. I'm grateful. I took a collection from all of us. It isn't much, but you've earned it. Money? No, hold on to that, you. Very good of you. Thank you. I'll take a bean. Will likely want to thank you too, mind. He returned just a while ago. I believe he's catching up with Corker. As for us... No armies at our heels. Amazing. We can finally leave. But perhaps we need not speak of farewells. We'll join your camp tonight to celebrate if you'll have us. We'll see you there. Fucking party at the gaff. What the bleeding lads. Oh, you guys. Use heading. I nearly dispatched those goblins myself, but it seems you managed well enough. And why wield a masterwork where a butcher's blade will do? My thanks, truly. You're gonna die soon. The cart sounds. Kaga was down in the thingamajigger, wasn't she? What? What the fuck is this? Addressing me, a humble ox. How quaint! What the fuck is going on? Something's off. This creature isn't what it appears to be. There's more to you than meets the eye. Care to explain? No. You are incapable. Sorry? <laughs> Fine. I heard the thief things are gonna butcher one of you for food, so your secret will die with you. Okay. <laughs> I'd so love to see them try. I'll tell you this much. I'm going to Baldur's Gate, with or without the rest of these poor sods. Now, that's all I have to say besides, and I really mean this, move. Nothing here for you. No. No, no, no. What the fuck is that? That's fucked up. Oh, Halson, hey, what's up? Oh. Beef? 
You took it upon yourself to undertake the right of thorns. I ought to exile you from this place. Forever. Instead, I shall listen to the explanation that you owe me. I owe you nothing. Goblins swarmed us like roaches while you stumbled after the past. You chose to abandon us. I chose to protect us. Silence! The right has been ended. I will allow you to stay, but consider yourself a novice anew. You have forgotten the ways of the druids, our place in the natural order. You shall learn it all once again, right here. Backslide, and nature's fury will crush you. As you wish, Master Helsin. Am I gonna pile on? She tried to imprison a child. <laughs> uh, yeah, fuck her. I don't like her. A misjudgment. One that should weigh heavily upon her. But the Grove still needs her passion. You will soon see why. But enough of that for now. I owe you my thanks. The Grove stands. Nature prevails. I owe you my thanks. And an introduction. Yeah, I was looking for you in the air. Uh... <laughs> First druid of the Emerald Grove. And I sense you have a problem you seek my help with. Uh, yes, I have a Mind Flayer Parasite inside my head and I want your help removing it. It's true. I can feel it right now. Oh, Oak Father, preserve you, child. But something's different. You're aware of the monster inside you. You don't bow to the absolute like the true souls do. I bow to no one. How is this possible? I escaped from an illithid ship after being infected. Maybe the process was interrupted. Perhaps. But I wouldn't want to place all my faith in blind luck. Luck has done little to help me now. very powerful magic to modify these tadpoles. They're using them to exert control over the infected. I'm sorry to say, I can't undo that magic. I can't cure you. But that doesn't mean I can't help. At the goblin camp, I hoped to find a way to remove the tadpoles. I failed, but I did find the next best thing. I found out where they come from. Ooh, okay. I will do what I can to help you. Let us speak tomorrow. You and I both have matters to see to first. As for what you've done for the Grove, speak to Wrath. He will see to your reward. What happens next? The journey to Moonrise Towers. And all the dangers that that entails. But that's tomorrow's problem. Take some time for yourself tonight. Rest. Celebrate. Come morning, I'll be by your side. Oh! Thank you.